Hi, I'm Joe with SureTrack. Uh, today we're going to show you how to install a bar lock on a side door. Pretty straightforward installation, so let's get started. Okay, so the parts that you'll need for this installation are obviously a bar lock uh, for that. You'll need two bar lock spacers, a hasp. You'll also need uh, four tamper-proof bolts that you're going to use to install the bar lock. You'll need two two and a half inch bolts to install the hasp. And I think that's all you need for as far as the parts wise. The tools, you're going to need an electric drill, a 21 64th drill bit, uh, a tamper proof bit in order to install the tamper proof screws, and then a half inch wrench and also a pair of vice grip pliers would come in handy as well. Uh, this installation process really applies to all sure track enclosed trailers. The reason being is we build our door frames out of three inch tube steel. Uh, so that what that allows us to do then is install the side door and at any given time in the future, a bar lock can be installed onto that. And we do that for all enclosed trailers with a side door. Okay, so to install the bar lock, first of all, you're gonna wanna center it on the door. The way to do that is to install or to center the handle of the bar lock up with the hasp on your door or the, the door handle itself. And that'll show you where to position your, your, your bar lock and you're going to want to put the hasps or the hinges right up against the edge of the side door. There's a three inch tube right behind that so you don't have to worry about hitting anything. So once you have your position of your bar lock, you know, take a felt tip marker or whatever and, and mark the holes where you're going to want to drill your four pilot holes for your tamper proof screws. That's going to be with a 21 64th drill bit. So after you get your holes marked, take your bar lock back off and drill out those four uh, holes for your tamper proof screws. Then to install that, you want to slide the bar lock spacer rather behind the bar lock hinge and then screw your tamper proof screws into that. That'll make a nice tight uh, installation. Okay, so the next step is installing the hasp onto the side door. You're going to install the hasp on the door itself. To find its position, what you want to do is take your handle on your bar lock, put it perpendicular to itself at a 90 degree angle, nice and straight. It'll come across the face of the handle of the side door. And your hasp is going to be positioned just to the right of that handle, of the door handle itself. You want to make sure the bottom of the hasp is up good and tight against your, your handle of the bar lock. But once you find your position, then take your felt tip marker, mark the top and bottom hole. Then you can drill those two holes out also with a 21 64th drill bit. And once you get to that step, then it's just a matter of bolting that hasp on with your two and a half inch bolts with your washer and nut. This is where your vice grip pliers and your half inch wrench is going to come in handy. Uh, you can hold the outside of the bolt, the carriage bolt, with the vice grips, and then on the inside, tighten up the bolt nice and tight onto itself. And that way, that will complete the installation of the hasp with your side door. All right, so that completes really the installation of the bar lock and the hasp. At this point, we want to take a bead of clear silicone and go around the hinges of the bar lock itself, also the hasp. That way, it'll keep any water from finding its way into the inside of the door or the trailer. Okay, so that's how you install a bar lock. Again, my name's Joe with SureTrack. Thanks for your time. Uh, this installation was showing you how to install a bar lock on a side door for any SureTrack enclosed trailer. Uh, if you have any questions or would like more information for, about our SureTrack products, uh, please visit SureTrack.com.